in the sky, gazing far into the Hello everybody, my name is Eric Cat, and today I'm going to show you how to get really cheap stuff online, okay? For Airsoft, obviously, because that, that's in the title. But, um, yeah, I bought this box right here, this crate right here, and this Tekken box right here, because they're like a bunch of gears, stuff like that, um, for around $30. So, let's get into it. Okay, so, let's see what's inside this bad boy. Oh my goodness. Now remember, $30. So first, we have a G&G &G Armament E-Bike uh, lower receiver. I mean, okay, whatever. Next, we got this uh, L96 sniper body. Next, we got this miscellaneous M16 stock. This knife. I'm just going to give this to my brother because I already have a knife, but yeah. Next, we have this Uzi. This is a gas blowback Uzi, I think. Yeah. Open bolt. Uh, I need to find a bag for this, though. I don't know if there's one inside here, but it's, they painted it gold. kind of a crappy paint job, but still. Um, yeah. Okay, so, a little update. Um, threw a CO2 into this thing, just for shits and gigs, but, um. Ah, can't reach the full auto button. Oh my goodness. Uh, next, we have this. Black Ops 1911. Uh, it came with three mags inside here, I think. I just need to find them. It also came with a holster. I'll find that later, whatever. Next, we have this little bag right here. Let's just go through this. Mid cap, high cap, a bunch of sound grenades. A really nice stock. Um, I think that this is a, a this is a PTS Magpul stock. Um, I don't know, probably expensive. It feels, it feels hefty. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, we got this lower right here. Um, it's a Troy Industries lower. Doesn't say... Okay, so... Plastic. I think. No? It might be metal. I don't know. And then there's a lot of gears in here. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but there's like a lot of gears. But there's a lot of Thunderbees also. So I'm just going to move this bag aside because I don't want that going everywhere. Okay, next. We have, let's count this up. One, two, three, four inner barrels. They have long, a little bit shorter, short, a little bit shorter. Next we have this uh, M4 outer barrel. I don't have a barrel nut for this, so I'm probably not gonna use it. Let's actually try to count this out. So we have one mid cap, two mid cap, uh, a low cap, uh, three mid cap, four mid cap, five mid cap, six mid cap, one mid cap. Uh, and three AK magazines and a stubby um, four high cap magazine. Oh, so much stuff to unbox. Next, we have the barrel for the sniper assembly. Uh, I don't know if there's a trigger system inside here, but I don't know. Uh, stock looks like it's a GNG armor stock, pretty standard. We have a shotgun, it's a really hefty shotgun. I think it's full metal. It is broken though, so I'll we'll try to fix that. It does take regular magazines, but whatever. This has like a lot of heft to it, it has a gold paint job. Looks pretty cool. Job is the next. We got a M4 outer barrel. I might actually use this. It's a short M4 on the middle. But it's no use, What's next? Okay, so this is pretty cool. A whole paintball paint. A regulator. This is a uh, LPR regulator. Uh, it, it's a Ninja LPR regulator, so. $100 regulator, 
a thirty dollar box plus the, the actual tank. Pretty sick if I do say my so myself. And I wasn't expecting this, but there is another regulator inside of here. Remember, I got this box for thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. Um, next we have a full uh, lower receiver and gearbox for a gas or er, uh, electric blowback GNG gun. Uh, with the motor inside there, pretty surprising. I just need to get a new fuse for this and it'll work perfectly. That's what it says on the tag at least, I don't know what the tag's from, but... Yep. So much more stuff, okay. Another stock, and a lot of stock. My stock's in there. Uh, M4, uh, Bell Proud, another Bell Proud, another Bell Proud, another Bell Proud. Um, oh, no. I have to use this, uh, I just want to know what he says he does. Sam, Bell Proud, Sam, Black Red, but still. Yeah, you have to feel like it's all done, but I think we're going to make stuff better. Ooh! Okay. Ooh, okay. 11.1 volt, uh, 2300 milliamp 20 or 12C battery. It doesn't look bloated, it looks fully intact, so. I might actually try using this. This is really cool. It's not the like I just plugged it in the gun. Sick! I'm running out of this. Okay, this is a 8.6 volt, uh, that down. Another, uh, 9.6 volt. But I do have this really broken pistol, like there's nothing inside of the upper slide, but all that function works, if you know what I'm saying. I have this headset. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Um, another one of your boxes is one that's not going to look at it, but whatever. I'm not having much about it, but I don't want to do a radio. This actually looks like a pretty nice radio. Uh, it's got AV, different channels, whatever. It's got a really long antenna, so that's gonna be a pretty long range. Radio can be a lot of Oh, that's uh, good. HPA line inside of here. This looks like, yeah, it's an amped line. Quick disconnect on there. It's a pretty short line though, so I don't know if I'll be able to use this, but yeah, actually, yeah, I think I'll be able to use that. It looks like a pretty standard line. Once I get my Inferno, which I'm probably gonna get soon, whatever. Awesome. Oh, that's okay. Okay. Woo okay. Yeah. Woo yeah. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Oh! Is this CO2? Is this CO2? Oh, this is CO2. 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 Okay, so that's it. Yeah, I have a lot of stuff I'm going to do. That's not Oh, 
Okay, so I'm gonna unbox this thing. It's probably taped up for a reason. That reason being, it's gonna fall. Every, all the drawers are gonna fall out, but yeah, see that. Okay, so let's look in the first drawer. Miscellaneous parts, screws. Um, uh, yeah. Fuses. Don't know what that is. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Wow. Looks like we got a sector gear right here. Oh, there's a dual sector gear for a second. Oh, sector gear. Um, yeah, sector. Oh, it's a sector. Uh, can you get it? Alright, here. Other pets. Uh, another gear. Here's the thing gear. Another thing gear. Um, oh. Found a nozzle. There's a thing that's not wrong, so I'm looking at that. Uh, let's see what's in the next drawer. Oh, got some tape on there. Okay, we got a, is this a metal flash rider? Metal, nice. Let's just get a flame torch this. No, not flame torch. Uh, heating torch. Ooh, nice to use inside there. What else? Allen wrench, hair cord, um, trigger parts. Um, ah. Next drawer looks like we got some, is this Loctite? Mm, cement for plastic molds, that's what it says. And don't know what this is for. It's part of an outer barrel. And what are these? Are these broken? Yeah, they're broken fuses, so. Yeah, we'll be able to use those. Okay, last one. Ooh. We got some cylinders and this is. Just classic stuff, so. Yeah, I could probably build a gun out of all the stuff that I got with you, so. I say definitely buy your guns on Craigslist. I mean, that's the best way that you can go. It's just 10 out of 10.